right, so I did say when I'm done, like, all my workouts for the day, I'm going to get on the scale. So, baby, baby, about to get on the scale. All right, you wanted to get to zero. And then I want to step on. I wish I had. I feel like I'm going to get extra pounds that I don't want. Yeah, a lot of extra pounds that I don't want. There's no way, like, I did something wrong. So this is after today's workout, and of course, I am about to get on the scale. We gotta get it to zero, so I'ma step on. Get it to zero. Matter of fact, Tink, since you stands in here, I don't wanna hold the phone out. It's to zero, I'ma save this. So it's on zero, slide over a little bit for me. And we just gotta go down. It's the fact that I made it to day two, y'all. And did y'all see how them pounds went down? Like, stop playing with me. Show up for yourself every single day, no matter what, because life going to life, but God going God. And I'm grateful. Come on, y'all. This day two. So I'm going to take a trip down memory lane right now. Here's back in April where I was on day five, okay? But I am on day two here in June. So what's so remarkable about this is that I kept showing up. I don't think y'all get it. Like, I'm going to always start over. And I'm going to always get back on track. Like, Mommy, it's important. Yes, princess? Zaya, I want me to have her all the way on. She uh, told me to put a timer on I said 25 minutes, TJ. I put it on for 25 minutes. What's it upon? Yeah, I'm doing a video voiceover you and um, in the midst of me working, of course, I'm going to be a mom. So, yes, I did tell Isaiah to put the timer on. Now, you got to split. I'm going to give it to you. It's not about to die, though. No way. Zaya, do you need it right this second? Mommy, yes. Mine is on 20. Hers is on 40. Give her you 10 more minutes. A hundred. I get my charger over there that I'm not using, if y'all don't mind. Go ahead, TJ. Mm -hmm. All right, give me a second. I will always show gratitude in every encounter because, baby, it's a blessing to be able to be a mom. And I'm going to take that on with great abundance, favor, prosperity, um, gratitude, love, wisdom. I'm going to just take it all in because I love being a mom, okay? So let me just get into understanding when you're shifting your mindset like you just have to take a moment and be still and as you're being still it's like the first thing in the morning in the morning so you get up do like a little stretch while you still sit in the bed like roll your neck do some airplanes with your arms do something okay what i want you to get and become intentional with is normalize waking up in a positive mood. If you can shift your brain that way as a parent, oh baby, you're in a great, girl. great um, I did position. Girl. So if you shift your brain girl. to normalize waking up in a positive mood, that will look like you basically, um, I'm going to say you're going to relax, like relax. So if I thought I'd do like my neck rolls and some airplanes and some deep breaths, I'm going to pray like I'm praying. I'm going to pray. I'm going to set my intentions for the day. I'm going to show gratitude. I'm just going to pray. Next, I'm going to drink some water. Like So it's important to put water next to your bed at night to drink water throughout the day like so with me being on day two and tomorrow which is july 1st i'm gonna be on day three i am drinking more water in this process of my journey um this is not just a weight loss journey for me this is a healing journey for me this is a gratitude journey for me this is a 
financial abundance war, um, journey for me. You understand? Like, I'm being intentional with everything. So my mindset is on increase. Like, I'm shifting my mindset and I'm sharing it with you guys as I'm doing it. Something that I don't normally do because I'm very private. So I like to show you all stuff years later or months later. Like, it's so many things that I have yet to expose about myself and where I've come from and where I'm going. I still haven't done a lot of things that if I would have started doing these things years ago when I first started this channel, I know my abundance would have been in tenfold. But when I tell you about normalizing, um, setting the tone for yourself, it comes with understanding what I've done in the past, understanding them goals that are still my goals, and understand where I'm at now. So when I sit back and look over my life, I examine these things. And now, since I'm shifting my mindset as a 36-year-old woman of four amazing children, I had three graduates in the month of June. I had three daughters having their recital for the first time in the month of June. I had so many amazing, I had four kids ending uh, school in the month of June and starting summer vacation. Like, there's so many dope, amazing things that happen alongside of so many tears that I cry daily. So many frustrations that I had to like keep a smile on my face and persevere and push through. So many um, unnecessary uh, occurrences of things that made me no good. I, I, I did it. I, I've been through it. I've gone through it. In, in the midst of all of these obstacles, I still showed gratitude and showed up to see the positive and make the positive of the month of June. And um, I, I, I'm, I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful for my perseverance and I'm grateful for my willingness to keep showing up because baby, I've been in the dark for so long or for a the duration of time that it no longer serves me. Like that's not serving me. So when I normalize waking up in a positive mood, I intentionally re relax. I objectively pray. And honestly, it sets a great tone for my day. So incorporating being fit to the T, getting wasted to the T, and taking over my health on a physical standpoint, I feel amazing. I'm grateful for that. I'm appreciative. Like, I'm a real blessed girl. And I want you to know, just like I had to understand that, God is working out things that you haven't even prayed for yet. He's the God who works ahead of time. Listen, and I just take this time to thank God, and I want you to keep showing up. Peace love and light.